Monday guys. So today is the start of a new week, a hectic and busy week for me. So I'm having an installation done this week. So this will be like the fastest and the shortest installation that I have I will have done because everything has to be done by Thursday evening because the client is flying in on Friday. So by the time she comes, everything has to be done. So what I want to do today is head out to Isili. There are some items that I shipped in from Alibaba and I'm told that they are here. So I want to go clear that one out. And then later on, I'll have to go to the house, check on the progress on of the painter. And then after I dash to town and get lights because I need to get lighting for the whole house. So that is the plan for the day. So let's head out and uh, start our day. to know has anyone tried shipping in stuff from alibaba since the last video that i did share so if you have no clue what i'm talking about i'll link the video in the cards above and also in the description box below i was um, explaining how you can ship your item from alibaba directly to kenya so today i have a lesson an entrepreneurship lesson 101 I'm just from picking the items that uh, I had shipped in for a client. So one of my clients requested that I do ship for them light fixtures from Alibaba. And uh, when doing the quotation, I used Kenyan shillings. Because uh, what, what, what I had in mind is I'll be using the same dollar rate that I used last time. Little did I, did I know by the time the goods were arriving in Kenya, the dollar would have gone up so today i go to pick up the items and the dollar has gone up from 114 to 124 shillings so the thing is my quotation was in kenyan shillings using the rate of 114 but now there is now these extra costs that uh, had not been budgeted for so you see, now the margins have to go down because of that. But anyway, every day is a learning lesson when you are an entrepreneur. You get to learn things every single day. So today I have learned, if I'm doing any quotations, I'll be doing them in dollar. So whichever rate will be... Whichever dollar rate will be at that particular point, that is the rate that you're going to be using. But uh, anyway, I'm happy the goods are here. They took less than two weeks. No, you don't mind the way I start my words. Mm, you know exactly what it means and how it hurts. Oh, I can't believe you're here. Can't get any worse. No. Cause when you get too close, I lose my way and 
looking for light fixtures Duruma Road and Sheikh Karume is the place for you to go and check out they have a wide variety of lights most of the lights that you get to see online but um, you get them there at a cheaper price so for instance the wall scones the range is from 2000 going upwards to around 4500 and then for the light fixtures you get from as low as 1500 shillings for that is a single light the long dining room or dining area lights you can get it from around 4500 going upwards but uh, the thing is as i always tell you walk around shop 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 around before you settle on a particular shop because you can go to a particular shop and get some that same same light at a cheaper price so make sure you first you window shop before you settle on a particular shop but if you have like a specific light that you have in mind and uh, you think that is the best price or maybe it's within your budget you can go for it but make sure you walk around because you might get even something way better than what you had in mind morning guys happy tuesday so the last time i spoke to you was uh, yesterday back when i had gone to the house to check on the progress that the painter had done but um, i didn't share that because there was no progress done so the thing is we encountered a little bit of a challenge my client is not around so she's um, flying back in this week on friday but she has not signed the lease so we cannot do any painting until she signs the contract so that is what we encountered so what we decided to do is we decided to proceed with everything else and then now we'll do the painting after after now everything has been done and the client has come in and signed the lease so i know this is like we're doing things the opposite way but um, there's nothing else we can do at this point so we are holding off painting until now i think some will do it maybe sometime next week now after the client has come but um in the meantime i'm supposed to shop for everything else yesterday i did get a few lights i'm supposed to get 17 lights in total and uh, I'm not even halfway through that number. So today's plan is to finish light shopping. And then I head out to Isili for curtain and carpet shopping. So it's going to be a busy day. So hopefully, fingers crossed, praying that I get everything today. Because tomorrow is supposed to be install day. Tomorrow on Wednesday, we're supposed to do the install and then now on thursday we'll be finishing touches so that means everything has to be like bought today because tomorrow there are some deliveries that i'm expecting so i'll be spending like a huge chunk of the day at the house so that is what i'll be doing so for now i want to quickly prepare breakfast and then head out and start my day so wishing you a lovely day even though this will be like weeks to come but uh, yeah that's the plan for today fingers crossed everything works out So now what we end
So I'm looking for something grey. So this is one of the options. This is not part of the options, but maybe it's something that if you're interested in. So there's that. And then there's this that uh, almost white. It's a bright grey. And then there is another one. This is darker. This is uh, the same as this. But now this is the brighter version. And then this is the darker version. Mm. So... Oh, and there is the white. Let me show you. There is this white. But this is um, what I'm leaning towards. So for one of the bedrooms, this is the one that we are going to use I love the detail and then the quality is it's heavy it's very heavy so this is the wrong side this is the other side Not only did I love their variety, but their customer service was so, so good. So I was looking for five different carpets for five rooms. So you can imagine for like one room, 
I was working with maybe like five options. So they were not getting tired because they would remove a carpet. I'm like, no, this is too much. Let's work with something else. So they remove another one. They just keep on helping me find a carpet that I want. And I found that one so, so, so encouraging because they were like, madam, if you don't get a carpet in this shop, you're going to go to our next shop and find you the carpet that you're looking for. And another good thing about them is maybe you're looking for a carpet, but you're not so sure if the carpet that you want to take home will go with your theme. So what they do for you is you can choose like your top three carpets. So the ones that you lean in most towards, and then they get you a rider, deliver the carpets to you, and then you try out the carpets in your space, the particular room that you want to put the carpet in. And then afterwards, you get to keep the one carpet that you choose and then they go back with the other two. You don't even have to go to easily for this. You can just send them your theme or maybe like your inspo photo. You send them on WhatsApp and then they get to give you like the different designs that are closest to the theme that you're working with. And then they send you the rider to your place and you get to choose and... Um, the others they get to be returned and that is a very very convenient thing because i'm thinking the hassle of going to easily alone it's so hectic so if they can give you that convenience oh my i was so impressed and eventually that is what i ended up doing for one of the rooms because i got a carpet but when i took it home it was totally totally off so when i went to return that's when they gave me that option they told me that they, they could have even done that from the word go but i didn't know so we now had to get three carpets my top three and then we took them home with the rider i got to choose the carpet that was closest to the theme and i was so impressed with the service because the option that I had, I would have taken from the shop was different from what actually worked with the theme. So that is a, that's a plus plus. The convenience of that is everything for me. So I think going forward, this is what I'll be doing. You select, you send a theme like an inspo photo and then they get to deliver the carpets and it's so 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 convenient and the best thing is you get to choose the carpet that goes with your theme like a hundred no guessing so this one is not you're not like second guessing yourself you're so sure you're like a hundred percent sure this is the carpet that will go with the theme in this room Thank you for watching up until this far and spending the week with me. I could not have recorded everything, but at least I've managed to record like a shop with me for curtains and carpets because uh, I do enjoy watching those because they give me like a rough idea of the kind of stock that they have at that particular point because you find that their stock keeps on changing. So at least when you get to watch like a recent update on someone who has gone to Isili, you have a visual of if the carpets that they have is something that you're willing to work with in your space. So that is it for today's episode. I hope you did get a thing or two from it and it was helpful. So if you did like the video, give it a big thumbs up, share it with your friends. And if you're new, kindly hit the red subscribe button below. So that is it. Until next time. Bye-bye.